three college students won the tech trip adventure of a lifetime. They spent two weeks visiting four of today's hottest tech companies where they teamed up to solve business challenges. This is their story. Alan Garcia, University of Houston. Kim Pham, NYU. Sir Billion Harris, DeVry University. Welcome to Tech Trip. We're on the Tech Trip Adventure of a Lifetime. It's week two, day one. We're about to check out Dolby and see what they got for us as far as sound goes. Nice to meet you. Absolutely. I put that on a hang glider. Okay, we don't always work here. Sometimes we have fun. Come on up. We know how the ear behaves and how we process things. Whatever you see the airplane take off and the airplane's coming right for you and it goes <laughs> that you heard it go over your head because that's what airplanes do. It didn't. It just went from the center speaker to the surround speaker. Wow. This is um, <laughs> one of uh, one of 17 surround speakers. This is a matte white screen. You can't see it, but there are holes in the screen. And the holes are there to let the sound squirt through. The first things we're gonna see are in 3D. That's those. That's a 76 by 76 checkerboard square. Yeah. And that's the Dolby Digital 5.1 track right there. So that's why we had to be clever in trying to get that much data into that small space. So we're going to jump right into a game demo. Um, this is going to be Dolby's Axon technology. And the goal has always been to make game sound as good as Hollywood movies. That's been the kind of bar that we've been striving to achieve. And my voice will get louder as I come back and get closer to you. As I move around, you hear me coming from your left. Behind you on your left, <laughs> behind you on your right. Three. I'm over here, so <laughs> if I wanted to sound more like an elf, I could do that. But we're going to listen to Tron in 5.1 coming off of our phone. Okay. Most people can't yeah, get their phone to do this. <laughs> and we have the other one. I grew up like on Dolby, basically. Yeah. All of our systems are Dolby. We want you to time travel into the future and show us how technology and entertainment define your lifestyle. What's going to happen over the next 10 years? Show us what you guys think and where the future is. I don't even know where to start. I really like the challenge that Adobe gave us. Uh, I'm a big technology person and the fact that they gave us something where we're trying to see what 2021 could bring. I have a billion different ideas. I, well, I guess I could show them to everybody. Yeah, so... Why don't we have the TV as an aggregating social hub? When I see the feature, I think holograms, like literally like screens that you move, you know? So it's day two here at Dolby. Um, we were given our challenge yesterday and we're really excited um, to present today at the Dolby screening room. We've been hard at work all night, so we're excited to get um, reactions from the Dolby marketing team. Mm -hmm. We're always going to be social as human beings, and we're always going to be one on into evolved technologically. The smart walls are basically panels that provide all your entertainment and informational needs. Like your news sources would be there, all scalable by touch. In your kitchen, if you want to know, like in another room, like your oven's preheated 400 degrees. So this is weather. <laughs> as our way of saying thank you, we want to give you guys a uh, party gift. And so we want to give you guys a nice oh little home God. theater system. <laughs> We're done. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> we ended on a good note at Dolby. I hope they were impressed with what we had to say. It was really awesome. You guys took care of us really well. Thank you so much.